Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Have any elections been overturned due to election fraud? Election fraud, though rare, has been a concern in various elections throughout U.S. history. To understand whether elections have been overturned due to fraud, let's delve into some significant cases. In the 1982 Chicago election, an estimated 100,000 fraudulent ballots were cast. Following a Justice Department investigation, 63 individuals were convicted of voter fraud, including charges of vote buying, impersonation fraud, and fictitious voter registrations. However, this case did not result in the election being overturned, but it highlighted the severity of fraud. A more conclusive example is the 2003 mayoral primary in East Chicago, Indiana. Here, widespread fraud led to the state Supreme Court overturning the election results. The fraud involved operatives filling out absentee ballots in exchange for jobs, and the new election resulted in a different winner. In Greene County, Alabama, an extensive investigation in 1994 uncovered absentee ballot fraud. Nine defendants pleaded guilty to voter fraud, and two others were found guilty by a jury. While this case did not result in the election being overturned, it demonstrated the impact of fraud on local elections. The 2015 City Council election in Perth Amboy, New Jersey, is another instance. A judge overturned the election after discovering at least 13 illegal absentee ballots had been cast, which decided the election by a mere 10 votes. Between 1978 and 2018, at least 14 elections were invalidated or overturned by courts due to absentee ballot fraud, with 12 of these being at the local level. This includes elections for offices such as county clerk, sheriff, judge, and mayor. In summary, yes, elections have been overturned due to election fraud. These cases, though rare, underscore the importance of election integrity and the legal mechanisms in place to address and rectify fraudulent activities. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.